hallway. So if you haven't seen it yet, and it was found here in New York State, not too far from the museum. So check that out uh, before you leave the museum today. But this map, interestingly enough, this is supposed to be a female mastodon, and they actually put Sorry. male mastodon tusks on there. I don't know how or why that happened, but it's just a little interesting tidbit for you there. Um, but this here is the fur that's covering the mastodon. We can find mammoth and mastodon hair very well preserved in the ice. This is real woolly mammoth hair. And we have mastodon hair here in the museum collections too. Uh, so the scientists took some of that over to the Vermont Teddy Bear Company. And they said, can you make us anything that looks similar to this? And this is what they came up with. So this is from the Vermont Teddy Bear Company, and if we could pet the mastodon inside the diagram, this is what it would be. So I'll pass that around, since we can't go inside and pet it. Now does anybody know when these animals are around? And then, and then, the yeah. And there was even a very small type of mammoth that managed to live until about Can I have your number? No. <laughs> I already got it again. It's a combination of the structure of the skull, but also. ready for that type of fight. I've been here. I've been in that fight. Yeah. It's a different type of fight. I've been here. I'm ready. Hmm? I'm not ready for give that. Give her the rest of our shoes back, please. Okay, it's a model, the one up there? Okay, well the mask is on in the window. It ain't real. We just learned that. It ain't real. Case in point. We just learned that. I told y'all it could be like...